Welcome back. We are here looking at the energy market, and this is going to be my weekly forecast for Monday, June 11, 2022. If you like to support the channel, you're going to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos and all my trades and all my, my, and my portfolio are available in the link down below. So let's look at the, uh, at the WTI. And as you can see, this week was a horrible uh, or the beginning of this week was horrible for WTI. But at the end of the week, it did ra rally quite significantly. So we did drop from $124 a barrel, went all the way down towards $95 a barrel. And this was basically looks like the bottom of this market. As you can see, we have tested it several times in the last few months, and we have basically bounced from that. We didn't get close to the 50 moving average, we got towards the bottom of the bullish band, and then bounced. We're still underneath the 20 simple moving we got rich, but breaking above this candlestick here, which is $113 a barrel, that could be an indicator that will go back towards the highs here of 24, all the way up towards $130 a barrel. So of course, outlook for the world economy is not really good. Uh, there is kind of mixed bag of data, uh, to be very honest. Europe is doing terribly and Asia is not doing it hard, uh, well either it's not getting get up to speed u.s economy is uh, stronger than expected uh, more resilient um, due to the, to the uh, rate in increase and so on but that will probably take time in order to see the effect of those but overall the basically break to the towards the bottom here was basically a fear that the world economy was slowing and that demand was not supposed to be is not as high as expected if we look at technical indicators, we can see the MACD is bearish, stochastic is bearish, and the RSI also is bearish. So momentum is definitely due to the downside. And if we were to drop below this area here, then we have the 50 moving average moving in this direction. And all the way down here, we have the 200 moving average as well. To the upside, is around $124. That is the top of this range. So let's look at the WTI oil. And this is well it has been a horrible horrible last five weeks for 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 lng so from 9.6 dollars all the way down to the 50 moving average down here at 5.3 dollars it has basically bounced and it's also a fairly weak bounce because we did rally quite significantly and then gave most of those gains back so this area here which uh, offered support in the past um it's kind of resistant now. It kind of looks like we are running into this area here and then it get rejected. If we look at technical indicators, we can see that MACD is bearish. Stochastic is still bearish, but crossing the signal line just barely and the RSI is flat. So at this current stage, it's difficult to see whether or not we will break down from here or we will continue to the upside. If we were to break down, uh, then the previous lows down here at uh, 3.6, that could be uh, targeted or uh, roughly four dollars around this area here uh, could also be uh, targeted uh, that's probably as far as this will go but to the upside we can look at Fibonacci retracement if we were to see a bounce from this market from this market then we can see that uh, we ran into a resistant right here at 23.6 then we have a 30 uh, 38.2 which is a seven dollars and you have the 50 at $7.5, and you have the 61.8 at $8. And that's probably as far as this will go. So we may see this uh, rally to the upside. That is plausible. Could we get rejected here? We could also get rejected there, and we could also get rejected there. Um, we have also the 20 simple moving average moving in this direction. We could also get rejected there. So if we break below this moving average, it looks like um, it's moving in this direction then we could be heading towards down to four and probably maximum down towards the 200 moving average as that's where we basically started this massive roller coaster to the upside so hope you find this helpful you want to support the channel by subscribing hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos good luck and thank you very much